Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Portia, I'm an iron worker, and of course I love all things beauty. So, without further ado, I would love to get into this review on my two absolute favorite shadows. They're the shadows, or rather two shadow palettes, my absolute favorite shadow palettes that I actually use for the bulk of my look. Of course, I use, of course, on my inner eye, and of course, you know, underneath any glitter, that is a totally different product, which is going to be on a separate video but in the meantime for today we're going to be talking about the main elephant in the room the two shadow palettes that i use to create this eye look that i have going on which i am absolutely in love with i'm dying for it's just amazing i would wear this sleep in it just i would do anything in it it's just that amazing and that awesome of course the camera does not do it justice it looks so much better in person if you actually saw me in person you would just be blown away this is just it's amazing the two shadow palettes i'm going to be talking about have two very different price points they're made by two different people um one of them of course is the very infamous pat mcgrath labs mothership palette which retails for 125 dollars and of course the very new beach cosmetics ultimate pro artist palette which retails for 20 dollars so you know without further ado let's get started like I said, we're going to actually start to talk about the biggest elephant in the room, which is the bigger of the two price points, the $125 Pat McGrath Mothership eyeshadow palette. And actually, I'm kind of like, why call it an eyeshadow palette when actually you get six eyeshadows, you get ten shades in this. Let me just say, it looks something like this. As you can tell, I've been playing with it. It looks something like this. It's very big. This is the front. This is the back. It is gorgeous it is amazing um you know it she tells you use without caution the packaging the component is just heavy it's luxurious it feels amazing um i really love it but to be technical you get 10 shades in them all 10 are not eyeshadows you got six shadows and four pigments so this would be better off called a shadow pigment palette rather than just a straight eyeshadow palette that's kind of a little misleading but other than that you know i would like to bring attention this is part of a permanent collection look at that that is just gorgeous so you get this beautiful it's just embossed it's just gorgeous absolutely gorgeous actually reminds me of something very egyptian ancient egyptian you know the from the pharaohs and all of that which you can kind of get that look and then you got the same little symbol back here embossed um these are made in italy so you know of course you're you know it's gonna be luxurious like i said these retail for 125 dollars there this is one of the three there are three of them 125 dollars each 375 dollars if you want to pony up the cash but if you don't feel like ponying up the cash right away you want to save your money save your coin then don't worry these are not part of her limited edition capsules like her other releases before this is actually in her permanent collection um and of course if you missed out on her last limited edition uh release of the lipsticks she will have all of those shades in her actually all those shades are in her permanent collection so you will be able to you know buy it if you run out of course it's not going to have the same um first edition stamp but it is going to be the same exact shade so that is good to know anyway it comes in like this when you get it at first it comes in this like old school if you remember from like the 90s the envelopes where you kind of winded it around and everything to hold your documents like a document holder that's what it comes in and then you know you undo it you get this and then in the bottom because if you notice on the back there are no shade names and inside there's actually no shade names either you'll get this card which tells you all the shade names you know so that's good that's very good it reminds me very much of the jacqueline hill for morphe palette the one that she just created um where it came with a card with all the shades names um on the card but if you lose a card unfortunately um you have to go online to find the name just saying um anyway you know this palette has been you know well loved well used and everything you know i love dabbling in this palette and you know to open it up i'm going to open it up and i'm going to show you guys 
just absolutely gorgeous so these four shades on the top one two three four are your um pressed pigments you know they're they're beautiful they're sparkly they're glimmery but like i said since they're a pigment you can't just put them on like your regular eyeshadow you actually have to take you know, like a nice flat synthetic brush you know something like this you know you want to mist it and pat it on or you can actually take your fingertip and you can go into the shade and pack it on um, but you don't want to swipe it on and of course you have these six shades which are just absolutely amazing they're shadows they're buttery they're creamy um, this black is a very buildable black so when you get it it doesn't like you don't get like a kaboom explosion a black you know is buildable to the intensity that you want another great thing is these do not have fall out like a lot of palettes with good pigmentation so you're not gonna have a dust bowl all over your vanity um, I'm actually going to do a couple of swatches of these I'm gonna do a swatch of the black I'm gonna do a swatch of this color up here and a swatch of this color here so these are three colors as you can see this is very 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 much a neutral palette um, I feel like it's probably the most neutral of the three palettes so if you're a neutral lover this is going to be the one that you're probably going to gravitate towards and I'm just going to swatch it on my hand right here as you can see it has good pigmentation it is very neutral so the black of course showed up the most of course this is the pinkier tone and then of course the neuter tone is over here um, you know but you know it's you know absolutely fabulous I absolutely love it pigmentation is amazing um, the pigments this pigment is the one that drew, drew my eye and um, this is a pigment actually to have in the center of my eye um, absolutely love it it's gorgeous it's it's just everything I live for it um, this green is a very very interesting green this one's called blitz emerald it's actually a shade shifting so it's a green with a black base so if you notice this green here if you actually turn it up like this it looks black so this is one of those ones if you want to create a lazy a lazy um, smoky eye you could with this palette or with this shade rather um, so this is what this looks like it looks something like this you can see actually see the the it's shade shifting right here and you know of course this one up here which is called VR nectar which is the one that I have look at that it's just it's everything it's just absolutely gorgeous I love this you know it's one of those ones that's just like this is a great travel palette um, especially if you're into those very sparkly looks and um, I'm definitely carrying this on vacay with me so you know you know that is that on that palette okay now now we're on to the other palette that I use to create everything else about my look with the exception of the glitter and that is by BH Cosmetics it is their brand new Studio Pro Ultimate Shadow Palette it is $20 you get 40 shades in there and I'm telling you this pigmentation on this is amazing the only gripe I have about this is the packaging it is very very flimsy very very cheap it feels like it could fall apart any minute other than that you know as you can see I have been playing with it I actually just got this yesterday I have been playing with it playing with it playing with it I absolutely love it this is definitely going to be the base one that I carry this is gonna be my base one this is gonna be my companion palette and this actually comes with four different finishes and shadows it comes with a matte your mattes, your shimmers, your metallics, and your duochromes. So, you know, for anybody who loves that kind of wants everything in one, this is a great palette. Um, I like the fact that when you open it, and you actually open it, and you look at all these shades, you have neutrals, colors, everything all in one. And I'm going to tell you, these neutrals are so so like the mattes are so buttery um i know morphe palettes retail for 35 shades for 25 dollars about 22 to 25 um and the shimmers in those are great but a lot of people gripe that the morphe palettes they're with the exception of jacqueline hill palette which was specially created that their mattes are hit and miss and with this one i've gone through 
a ton of mats as you can see I've you know I've kind of touched on you know I've touched on quite a bit of it and um, I have come to realize that they are not chalky they are not um, they're not patchy they're they're really good quality for the price especially and also the fact that I appreciate is that they're buildable which is great because you don't get this explosion of color that's really hard to blend out you can build it up to your desired intensity so this is actually a really good palette if you are a beginner getting into makeup this is probably a really good palette for you it will have pretty much everything that you would need to create a look um, and it is pretty reasonable um, I'm gonna actually show you swatches I'm gonna actually you know dip into a couple of mattes so you can see I'm gonna actually dip into this rust tone and this um, you know reddish tone and I'm actually gonna dip into that black because I know I did that with the Pat McGrath so you can kind of see what the black looks like so this is the black this is like the orangier shade that's the orangier shade and this is like that rusty shade and I'm going to show you when I swatch look at that that pigmentation is beautiful I didn't even press hard I think it's absolutely gorgeous it is very blendable you know it is very blendable you know like I said you do get good pigmentation when you pick it up on your brush um, you know you have the dual chrome shades so you have like you know dual chrome shades which you know you have these they're like absolutely amazing you know very pretty they're just it's, these are just really good quality shadows and of course this is going to be the main palette that i carry with me to create my looks of course it's what i used on the inner it's what i used on the outer it's what i use for pretty much most of my look and i am super happy so yeah that's my uh that's my tea on the two palettes i'm absolutely obsessed with they are vacation worthy i am definitely planning on purchasing a backup of both um because i could actually see myself carrying this with me um you know whenever i go out of town for multiple occasions if i had to spend the night somewhere i i could definitely see myself um you know carrying that with me um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this review. Make sure you subscribe to the button. Subscribe, it's either here or here, somewhere there. Um, subscribe and, you know, I hope that wherever you are, enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Enjoy the rest of your day, your weekend, um, you know, your night, whatever. Just enjoy it, you know, and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Bye.